Good evening, everyone. For those of you who are tuning in, this is Soul Work, and we're live here on Shaw TV. And I'm your host, Jenny Cousins. And we have officially opened up those phone lines, Calgary. So make sure you give us a call, 403-539-6710. And on tonight's show, I do have two very, very talented, unique guest stars, as I call them. And this is Jill Maria Robinson and Joe Pringle. And for those of you who have watched from the beginning, you have heard them sing. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. I can't express that enough. It's, I love music. It goes right through me. Yeah. <laughs> me it, too. It, 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 well, it would go right <laughs> through you. So who are your biggest inspirations? Take it first. Yes. Lord Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, for sure, um, my biggest inspirations in, in real life uh, would be my mother, who got me interested in, in arts. I kind of wasn't super into it when I was younger, but uh, definitely inspired by her. Uh, Alan Stickle, good dear friend of mine, who's taught me how to, to love myself and be who I am. Zuli Alnahas, who started my career, of course. And uh, anybody who's doing, who's out there, Honestly, when I open my Facebook page and somebody's doing something, I'm so inspired and I feel like, hey, I should write about that, that's cool. Or I feel like, you know, I should challenge myself to like maybe do something like that, you know. But an inspiration for singing today, you. Aww. I wanted to make it, make it exciting, you know, for uh, to come on here. I, I don't do very many interviews, so I thought, let's sing. And then grab yes. Joey and he said, let's do it. So yeah. I'm very thankful to you. Oh, you're very welcome. You had to come on. Yeah. Yes. So who's your inspiration? For coming on the show, of course, you and Jill. Aww. Because you guys rock. <laughs> um, uh, for music, um, I would say just growing up uh, with a single father, he always played in a band. He always played music. Um, so that's kind of where all my music started out coming from. So definitely my father. And for, for artists, different artists through the years, Johnny Cash, like all the cl classic country guys. Um, Stevie Ray Vaughan, he's a big one. The hat. Yeah. Yes. He's so was, Stevie Ray Vaughan. Yeah. Yes, I was just going to ask you guys about that, the, the groovy style you're, you're sporting around with. Yeah. <laughs> she's got, she's got, I know, she's, it's a different look for me for sure. You guys yeah, yeah. both have the grooviness. Like, I want to be performing for you know? people, you know. Yeah. I don't want to just be who I am when I'm got singing. No. I'm enjoying kind of doing the yeah. Jimi Hendrix flair and kind of like the cool Rastafarian hair, you know. I'm into yeah. It. yeah, you, you got to keep it real. Androgynous yeah. look, I'm into that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you got to keep it real and be yourself. Yeah, you you really true. do. Because everybody, I believe everybody has a gift. Yeah. Everybody has a talent. Yeah, and we should Big use time. that yeah. to yes. better the world and influence change in what we believe in yes. and our yeah. background. You know? That's exactly yeah. the way it is because everybody has their own uniqueness about them. Yeah. And I, I will actually I point and I poke people you to bring that? out the talent. Yeah. You know, because when I see it, it's like, no, you got to get it out. Yeah. Got to get it out. Yeah. Because it's in true. you, right? Oh, it yeah. It yeah. Always is. And you got to find it and then let it out. You do, yeah. and and you can't care what anybody else thinks. You got to no. keep it real, as That's I always say. That's the hardest say. part, yeah. Jenny. Come on, you know, like when you're doing your art, when you're doing anything, and you're sitting, not thinking about anybody else around you doing it, and then you put it out, and then the comments come. It just seems kind of like okay, got to think of it and be strong. They are jealous because why on earth would they even say a negative thing if they don't like it? They don't need to say it. Yeah, but the bottom. So, yeah, the bottom line is though. So I mean, it. it especially you know you're gonna get people that love you that hate you that like you that yeah. don't like you you know and it and it doesn't come <laughs> down to severe. them it's about you keeping it real and being yourself because the whatever you're doing the work that you're doing you know whether it's a musician or yeah. um, somebody works at Walmart or, or anybody they yeah. each have their own gift to offer to the world mm -hmm. That's so you true. can't worry what other people think. You really can't. Yeah. I always say that like I don't think anybody is better than anyone. That's right. And we're all yeah. just living our life, living our legacy, and people should respect that and support that. And if they don't, then that's okay, actually. Yeah. So, yeah. but it's it's super fun when people dig it because you, you well, feed you off that it. energy, you know, and you just love yeah. it. Yeah. 
Yeah, and everybody has their unique. I can tell right away, like just the energy as you guys were pulling up. I'm like, yeah, I'm feeling it. <laughs> yeah. I was actually. We're open hearts, you know. Like I tell you, I like people that. like my yeah. my like social security number if they ask. You know, I'm just like this kind <laughs> of don't person. Do that, yeah, I don't. I don't recommend that. Anymore, but don't don't do recommend that. that. So let's say now. Let's say, if out of any musicians, okay, who are alive or not alive, if you could play with any one of them, who would it be and why? Okay. Okay. Uh, LP, Laura, I, her name, last name is so hard to say, but she's like this cool new musician. Very cool. she, she's been around the block for sure, but Lost on You song, whew, as soon as I, I saw that song, she actually inspired me. And I said, oh my God, I would love to play with her, you know? Yeah. Obviously, that probably wouldn't happen, but oh, I don't you know, do you know. never know. I might never reach out to her and never. say, hey, you wanna? When you set that intention out there, believe me, magic can happen. We saw it. Remember? Well, well I will check it after the phone. Yeah. I, I just asked Joey, you know, I said, hey, do you want to play? And he said yes right away. Yeah, I don't no. think he even Bring knew it. my, I could <laughs> yes. sing. But I'll play anywhere. Yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. Actually, you and I, we met before at, uh, at first the bass. first bass, and yeah. he brought his guitar just for fun to play for Al before his uh, surgery and stuff. Yeah. And then we were enjoying uh, humming and awing and stuff, so that's yeah, how I, I connected with him. Some of the yeah. blues that I was writing there. Yeah, and it's yeah. very good. Yeah, she dug it. He's so. going to have a CD out soon. I've been pushing him to do that. Yes. Yeah. I'll be after you if you don't. Yeah. I'm coming straight to you, Jim. Yes. Yes, I You're really should one. hope so. <laughs> Yay. You heard that, Calgary. Exclusive on the Jenny Cousin yeah. Show. <laughs> so who's your biggest yeah. inspiration of, I mean, like, who would you play with? If I had a chance, I got so many. I'm thinking. You would. Do I, live, if, because then you could reach out to them maybe from. Well, yes. alive, probably that's, like, passed on it's sit, probably yeah. Waylon Jennings okay sit down and we could have a beer or write a song or two you know or Johnny Cash of course okay um let's channel them in yeah I don't know all my all my favorite artists have already passed on <laughs> right now I, yeah. I'm kind of I think so. channel them in I did that yeah. with, with Jim Morrison yeah oh. yeah Van Morrison wow. that's that who Jim that's Morrison. who I like to try to sound like that oh. would be wicked you know what Use I mean your own sound. yeah yeah but you'd play with Hendrix. Hendrix. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm a country blues guy, but I can I can rip it up funky to funk blues, you know. Yeah. I'm gonna hold you to that. Hey, wait. Right. I you heard it first here. She's only <laughs> hired in the band, you know. So next time. Oh you know. yeah, I, I'm coming straight here. Oh yay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What do you play? Oh, we won't even go there. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, so if I'm coming no. back here, Jenny, I'm gonna get you playing on the something. Oh, good lord. I'm going to get you on the spoons. If I can do it, Jenny, spoons. you can do it. The spoons. <laughs> <laughs> I use my forks. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, what the heck. And we do have a caller. We do? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. I know Mich Michelle. Michelle has a question for us. Oh. Well, Michelle? Hello, Michelle. Hello. 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 You have a question <laughs> for Joe or Jill or myself? No, just more for a general reading. Um, okay. I was just wondering whether I'm sort of going in a new direction now and whether it's the right direction. Okay. Um, what, what you really need to do is you are stepping into the right direction and within the next, I see the number three, so within the next three weeks, you might very well take that direction that you're going and actually take that direction and even go into another direction, but they're both connected into one. So as you're stepping into this new direction, be open, be open. Okay. Because next year for you, actually, there's, you're gonna have a lot of new doors opening for you. And what, what month is this? November, December, January, February, so number three. So in, in February, after the 17th, you're gonna have another opportunity open as well. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's good to know it's been a rough few years. What's that? It's good to know because it's been a rough few years. It, it has, but your cycle is ending. 2016 is year of completion. So you're completing out um, a lot of different things that you need to surrender and let go of. And when you're doing that, and as you have been doing that, and from now until the end of December, you're going to go through another major healing phase. So just go with it, tune into it, let go. And um, 2017 is, is going to be a better year for you. Never Thank lose you, faith. Good never to know. Lo never yes. lose faith. Oh, oh, yes. It can be a bit tenuous at times, so it's nice to just have a second opinion, you know? <laughs> yeah, but seriously, as, as even as Jill said, you got to have the faith. 
You know, we all, if, yeah. if something's kind of going a little wacky or if I'm kind of uncertain about things, I'll surrender it to spirit, you know, and yeah. you, you just, especially certain things you can't control, surrender to spirit, stay open, spirit, I'm open to receive, and they'll come and they'll show you and they will give you different signs. But next year for you is going to be much better and you're actually, and whenever you're getting that pull to go away, you're going to go away and, um, and just go with it. Don't just wing it. Okay. It'll, it'll, you're going to know exactly what I mean. Yes, be open to it because you, it's going to be by the water and the beach. So it could be, you know, like the Okanagan somewhere, but go with it. And don't worry about bringing anybody else with yeah, you. Yeah, well, I live alone, so that, that's not an issue. Yes, so. just seriously. Like, I, I live alone and I travel alone. I've traveled other countries on my own. So yeah, you, do. you don't put your life on hold waiting for different people. You just go. And, and this is why because you're going to meet a whole new clan of people, part of your soul tribe, as I call it. So be open. It's going to be a good year. Thank you very much. You're welcome. That's you're welcome. A good Christmas gift. Bye. Yes. Bye. Yes. It, it is all about the faith and believing. Not, not uh, giving up on yourself oh, when no. anybody else has. Or... No. No, can't. No, you, you know, especially right now, change in Alberta, you know, with the economy and everything, it, it's hard on everybody. It affects <laughs> Trump everybody. being president. <laughs> well, don't get me started. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> you, you know, so. Life is changing. The it, view it is. of what, what life is and what we want to accomplish. Yep. I feel like everybody's kind of like, oh, I do want to make a legacy for myself, but there's the people that want to live a simple life. And it's just like interesting. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I yeah, think we exactly. all need to figure out what we want we are. out of life. Yeah. Who we are. Yeah. And that's why it's so important to be you. you be, be yourself. You, yeah. you know, and, and the, like my attitude is and always has been for many reasons is this is me, take it or leave it. Yeah. You, you know exactly. what I mean? Yeah. Because you'll attract the right people to yeah. you. Yeah. And the right circumstances at the right time, divine timing, as I call yeah. it. So it all intertwines. Yeah. You know, yeah, and see, being focused. You know, how you two now yeah. singing? Look at that. Nah, who knows what's going to happen with that, you know. We, we, we wrote already two more songs. Hey. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't recorded it or anything, but. No, you guys would be at events. You think so? Yeah. yeah. What do you see for us? Do you think we should keep pursuing it? Yeah. Yeah, uh, absolutely. Abs absolutely, you will be. I yeah. think so. Yeah, it's going to really open up for you. Like, really, really, really open up. Be. You know, the folk festival is coming up, too. Don't forget. Yeah, I want to play with Tom Jackson. There you go. And Christian Hudson. I'm going to reach out to both of them. I know them both. So Yes. Going to play together, that guys. That would be awesome. Yeah. Yes, and, and that's it. You set the intention. When yeah. you set the intention, magic happens. Yeah. I think we all know. Like, sometimes thoughts come into my head where it's just like, Jill, you should do this. This would be good for you. And then you don't listen to it. And then you kind of like, oh, man, I knew the answer. Write it down. Oh, I never write anything no, down. No, no, do it. Seriously, I, do it. So bad at that. I, I remember one day I was so, like, just really stressed out. I couldn't calm down, believe me, I did everything. And, and then I opened up a bottle of wine, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> of course. And, and then I, I calmed down. And I ended up doing, like, a huge board. And I wrote 20 things I wanted to achieve this year. Yeah. And I've oh, done yeah. most of them. Yeah. Because That's when you're awesome. in that calm state, yeah. you surrender, then... Yeah, never make a decision when you're upset, believe me. No. Or texting when you're upset. Oh, geez, that Worst never ends well. Worst thing you can do. No, especially if it's like 2 o'clock in the morning. 100%. <laughs> That's what it usually After happens. two bottles of wine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so look out. No. <laughs> I've got your uh, numbers now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know. I know you on Facebook. Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. So now what drew you guys seriously into playing with each other, into creating a song, into saying, hey... Um, I think I, I shared that at the beginning. Like, I just met Joey randomly at a, a bar. You know, Coincidentally, no, yeah, right. But I was with my friends Al and, and Neil Enoch. Yep. And um, we were enjoying, like, hanging out. And then Joey came down because there was music that night. And he literally just, like, came and played for us. Yeah. yeah. And, like, because Alan, he's, like, super into this old school kind of music. And he was just like, yeah, you play, yeah. So we were playing all night. And then I was like, ooing and aahing. And he was like, you're kind of good. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> so then <laughs> it's just like a silly fun, you know, just yeah. meeting each other. Yeah. And then when, when exactly. you had said, sure, let's do, let's be on the show. I thought, oh, crap, I can't sit for my, oops, sorry. I can't sit forever and talk about myself. So I thought, okay, wow. let's sing a song. 
No problem. And then just messaged him. Wow. Yeah, thanks, thanks for doing this. See how amazing that, that happens? And <laughs> I'm already getting the wrap up sign already. Yeah. So the CD's coming out. Yeah. Doing lots of recording. Yeah. Yes. And the magazine hits the shelf when? Uh, in December. There you go. On shelves. And I want to thank you both for coming on. You will be both back again with thank another so song with your CD. You. Yeah. And this is Soul Work. I'm your host, Jenny Cousins. We're live on Shaw TV. Tune in next week for another show. Good night, everyone. Take care.